tax rate? <coughs> no. And I take it that this three million that you said that you that Brown identified is a one-time deal that doesn't have anything to do with the future years, does it? Commissioner, each year, if we're lucky, we see a surplus. Our, Commissioner, I'm going to answer your question, but I'm going to answer it my way. Each year, we, we have a revenue surplus if we're lucky. This year, we have a revenue surplus. Uh, as you're well aware, we bring forward a very conservative budget each year. So, Commissioner, I'm trying to answer your question, please. We allow me. Commissioner, uh, Commissioner Bailey. Let me make sure we understand my question. Okay. Do you plan to sponsor pre K with three million dollars for the next few years? Commissioner, as revenue is available up to three million dollars is what our plan calls for. We we have identified three million dollars for the past fiscal year to conclude on June thirtieth, and what we're suggesting is going forward uh, as we identify up to three million dollars that will be dedicated to pre K. So you you're saying that you're making the I'm saying we are saying as revenue projections. Commissioner, you want a yes or no answer. I'm not going to give you a yes or no answer because it depends upon revenue collections. Okay, and that's the best answer I can give you. We will, we will, uh, based upon revenue projections, make the commitment. education at all. Uh, I'm going to always be involved in education. And when the timing is such that we can make constructive proposals, that we're going to make constructive proposals. And I think this is a constructive proposal. And I, and I guess my final question is, is there a reason why the school system, the county school system, came up with pre-K program? They're willing to do it, I think. I think, I think you, you take it right by they're willing to do it. Did they propose it? No. They didn't propose it in their budget this year. They didn't request it. Uh, after some discussions with some of the commissioners, they agreed to do it. Uh, but they have not put a proposal on the table or anything that uh, suggests how they intend to expand their pre-K. Uh, I would say that we've had the, quite frankly, we've had the leg up on this proposal. Uh, the city school system had, had told you all earlier when they submitted their budget that they were not including this. It's only been within the last uh, few weeks of discussion that they've agreed to accept the money. So uh, I think we're the ones that have come forward with a progressive plan that uh, really focuses on sustainability over the long term. And, and finally, so no one will be disappointed in terms of your comments. You're not assuring us that we're going to have pre-K next year on your proposal. Commissioner, I would restate what was state, stated earlier. Uh, as we have revenue surplus, which fortunately we, we've had in the last few years, uh, as we have revenue surplus, we're committing up to $3 million. Thank you. Thank you, Commissioner Bailey. Commissioner Mulroy, this is your second time. Thank you, Mr.